Hi, this is Mickey Tyrone, and I'm very excited about the opportunity to do a course for the Chesapeake Forum this coming semester on the Navy in the Civil War, the U.S. Navy. Uh, this is a very, it's a story that is not very well known and needs to be appreciated by everyone. Um, it is almost miraculous that uh, the Secretary of the Navy, Gideon Wells, is only known for what he said at Lincoln's bedside when Lincoln died, and that is that uh, he now belongs to the ages. People don't know all that he did, almost miraculously, um, uh, to organize the Navy, uh, both in the ocean-going Navy and the river fleet, which was non-existent prior to the war. He did all that by pulling together within weeks after the Fort Sumter the key people who organized, uh, naval architect uh, Samuel Pook from Boston got together with James Eads from St. Louis and they created the, and designed and started to build the, the river boats, the river gunboats that effectively turned the tide in the Western theater. It was because of these naval efforts that the Union was able to take Fort Henry, Donaldson, and, and within months more, they took New Orleans, Memphis, Nashville, and that's a story that, that is a naval story, as well as the combined operations with the, uh, with the Army. So it's a story that we should all know better, and we'll, I think you'll be excited to learn the, the, the big picture. So thanks very much for attending.